A plea for help tonight from residents at Woodland Park Apartments. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brad Bird. And I'm Shelley Kirk. Evansville City Councilman Alex Burton met with residents who are still living there. Now, last week, they faced a utility shutoff because managers at the apartment complex didn't pay their bill. Eyewitness News Jill Wilderman was there tonight as those residents voiced frustration and pain with Burton. So where's the money going? What's it, where's it been going? What's going on? You know, because I know I got my receipts. So where's, where's that money at? There have been several questions like those from residents of Woodland Park Apartments. Councilman Alex Burton says some residents last week received eviction notices on their doors for unknown reasons. Burton held an open conversation tonight for current and former residents. That's really good that, you know, it's not just we're just all sitting here like sitting ducks, you know, waiting for an answer. Uh, uh what are we going to do? You know, so I appreciate that and the community appreciates that. A sense of community in an apartment complex, which William says is a tight knit one. If, if we could get it to be good or they could uh, fix the problems and stuff, I'm pretty sure you could ask most of these tenants and they don't want to leave. But when you have so many things piling up and piling up and piling up, you have no other choice. You have to do what's best for you. Williams says starting last week, many residents have already begun doing just that by moving out of Woodland Park. It pretty much everybody's just fed up, even if they're not moving immediately or they're not, you know, getting the help from people. People are starting to think like this probably isn't the best place for me. Feed Evansville has also been here tonight handing out bags of produce. They say they've only distributed about a fraction of the amount they normally do and believe that's due to the amount of people moving out of the complex. But I will say that it's a little bit more somber or quiet than it used to be um, today than it has been in the past. And I think it's just because of everything that's been going on. People are worried. Where are they going to go? Williams says she knows that feeling, and at the end of the day, her children come first. I don't know where I'm going to go just yet, but um, I'm going to go somewhere because i got to make sure that my kids are straight. In Evansville, Joe Wilderman, Eyewitness News. For new information.